We are Sean, Emma, Rex and Maggie and our motorhome Renny and together we are the Search 365. Welcome to episode 8 of our Northern England tour. Um, we have decided today to come out to High Force Waterfall. Um, as usual, I didn't get much sleep last night worrying about the roads to get here. Sean offered to drive, I was going to get the bus. So, no, we drove the van up here. Actually wasn't too bad, no. the roads. Few narrow bits, but perfectly fine. And the, <laughs> my second anxiety was whether we'd get a parking space because... It's obviously quite a you know popular attraction here and we've arrived at like what's the time half 11 just before half 11 which um is too late really we probably should have got up early and the car park is less than half full <laughs> so we've got an amazing spot haven't we yeah and the, as you can see this is the car park there is a bit for coaches so they must they do cater for the big coaches as well huge car park overflow car park over there as well we've got a nice big spot with an overhang so we can keep well out the way um and i think you pay to go and see this waterfall so it's a couple of quid for people to go down dogs are allowed so that's no problem and i think from here i read it's about a 20 minute walk from the car park down um to the actual waterfall so not far at all and there's a hotel here so yeah. I'm assuming they've probably got some kind of public house or tea rooms or something, but we'll check that out after we've been for a walk, maybe. So yeah, so we're going to go and check out the waterfall, aren't we, Mumu? Hiya. Tea, please. Go take a small bowl, please. Very okay. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Yeah. Yes, yeah. I do. <laughs> Just across the road as you head through the gate. Lovely, thank, thank you. you. Cheers. Yeah. This waterfall is going to be epic. Well, let's hope so. <laughs> the last one we went to, we weren't expecting anything. And it was alright, wasn't it? It was, it was good, yeah. But this one I think is huge. Come on. <laughs> Um, this waterfall is on the, and I'm not sure how to pronounce it, Rabbi Estate. Do you reckon it's Rabbi? Rabbi Estate. Estate. So it's beautifully maintained. Lovely path, that's what you pay your £2 entry fee for. Yeah. Um, keep this path well maintained. Lots of places to sit if you get a bit tired. Yeah, it's lovely.
get the best viewing possible, we would recommend visiting the waterfall midweek and not during the main season. We were lucky and the waterfall wasn't too busy, allowing us to clamber over the rocks for a better viewpoint. Once we made our way back up, we stopped for a cheeky beer at the hotel. The Teesdale Barnard Castle Caravan and Motorhome Club site is situated approximately half a mile from the town centre by a lovely woodland walk. The site is well laid out with large hard standing pitches with grass areas in between, all with electric hookup. This site is suitable for caravans and motorhomes and is dog friendly. The reception area is right next to the main entrance and has an information room next to it. There is direct access from the site to the footpath leading to Barnard Castle Town Centre. All the pitches are very flat and beautifully maintained. There are a few fully serviced pitches available, plus a motorhome service point. The toilet, showers, laundry room, dishwashing area, family washroom and disabled shower room are all in one block behind reception and are clean and excellently maintained. There are the usual water and rubbish points dotted around the site too. There is a dog walking area and a children's play area. There is some road noise at rush hour times but otherwise it's very very quiet at night. We really enjoyed our time staying at this site and would recommend it to others. Next time on episode 9 of our Northern England tour, we head to North Yorkshire. Rennie encounters a massive big hill, we check out Dolby Forest and take a stroll around the town of Pickering.